call it a Kartike Singh. Uh, I am posted to 45 squadron of the Flying Daggers and I am the squadron pilot in the unit. Our aim here is to raise the first uh, LCA Tejas unit of Indian Air Force. It is the first uh, indigenously developed high performance fighter of Indian Air Force. It specializes in uh, both the roles of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground, uh, that is to say it's a multi-role aircraft. The aircraft inherently is designed to be unstable, uh, wherein the onboard computers make sure that uh, they work to keep it stable at, in all the regimes of the flight. My name is Squadron Leader Samrat. I'm, I'm posted to 45 Squadron, the Flying Daggers, flying the indigenous Tejas aircraft. Tejas aircraft, if you look at its history, has got a very good track record of not having a single incident in about 4,000 plus sorties which, is, which it has flown including the testing as well as the operational squadron flying. The best part about this aircraft is the indigenous hand in the mission computer which enables us full capability to develop its weapon carriage as well as operational capabilities. Hence, the machine as such is very potent uh, combat platform and is capable of taking on any class of adversaries should the need arise. The avionics system of the Tejas aircraft is the USP if you ask me. I would like to simply put it that uh, anybody with average psychomotor skills can fly this aircraft. It is such a simple and such a bliss to fly this aircraft. The first uh, team, which the seven of seven pilots and the other engineering officers, which consists of the flying daggers as of now, take immense pride in the fact that we have been the chosen ones to induct this fleet safely into the Air Force and train the generations to come. The bond which I have developed with the Tejas has gone to such an extent wherein I have spent a whole night under the aircraft when it was being rectified after a snag in the hangar right here. I am Wing Commander Manish Tolani. I belong to 45 Scorn Flying Daggers and I am proud to be a part of a Flying Daggers family who happens to be the first squadron to induct our own indigenously developed light combat aircraft, Tejas. I'll take you around the aircraft to briefly explain what it is capable of. Tejas aircraft is highly advanced multi-role aircraft which has state-of-the-art avionics, weapon systems, navigation systems and a multi-role radar. The cockpit of the aircraft, it's a fully glass cockpit. What I mean by a glass cockpit is there are no, no analog instruments at all. All the instruments are, all the displays are digital. and an exceptional display and sighting helmet by which I mean on the helmet there is a visor and all the aircraft most of the critical aircraft parameters including the target parameters are available on the helmet as well in addition to the head up display. Now this is the wing of the aircraft unlike a conventional wing this is a delta platform it gives exceptional maneuverability in close combat so it is capable of good low speed as well as high speed performance. This aircraft encompasses a fly-by-wire system and coupled with the delta wing, it gives total carefree handling to the pilot. Below the wing, there are weapon stations. Tejas aircraft has multiple weapon stations, both under the wing and under the belly. It can carry Russian, Western as well as indigenous weapons on these weapon stations. The engine of the aircraft is highly reliable and extremely fuel efficient which has been proven worldwide since it is being used by various uh, fighter aircraft across the globe. Tejas aircraft has tremendous operational capability and we as a squadron are working really hard and fast to fully operationalize this beautiful platform as early as possible. And to become a fighter pilot in the Indian Air Force is a dream come true and flying this mighty machine is the pinnacle of fighter flying. So for all those who are wishing to or willing to take up Air Force as a career, this bird is right up there.